like the person well um, if you are joining us for the first time so welcome and um, today I will be I see, telling us about something else. Um, I'm talking about why do people know it? I posted um, during my live stream on Facebook question came up like why do people worry because I really wanted to ask why do people worry I know that like maybe other people because I've been in situations when then when I used to worry so the first thing is um, someone wrote this the first thing um, is people worry because of fear so it could be fear of not being able to cause change, the change to something. For instance, um, maybe where your fate or the fate of a person depends on your higher power. Let's take the, 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 the cause of a judge and um, a prisoner. Right? Uh, the prisoner might be anxious of the result what the judge is going to give him and depending um, on what he did sometimes it could be like okay yeah, i'm going to spend well, two days in, in jail no problem right or i'm going to spend one 24 hours in jail no problem but um, just imagine if to the life sentence just that and this is like actually like okay do i get the life sentence or do i get do you understand what I mean? Yes. That kind of thing, it could cause people to worry. And sometimes it might not even reach that extent of, um, the, the, it might just be your fate, the person's fate, <laughs> in the hands of um, maybe a teacher. So someone just maybe higher than you, a senior in school, for instance. Do you understand? Um, so the person is not in total control of what happens or the result of that and then secondly this could be fear the, the fear of the unknown the fear of the future I saw a quote that says the future is yet to come are you afraid about it? Because it can't happen yet. And you can do everything to change it. <laughs> that's that's something about the future. I um okay, let me give you this illustration. Um maybe years ago, right? I always used to have this kind of um um fear concerning like um okay what will i do when i get to this stage in my life i haven't gotten there yet though. but i'm just like cool okay what will i do what will i do but i'll get there <laughs> okay the second thing um he said people that causes people to worry um, is that they just want to worry some people have their mindset tuned to the channel of worry they they are programmed to worry it's like if they don't worry they feel like everything is not normal so they, they just worry they keep worrying <laughs> they meet them they worry they complain and those people are mostly well seriously they are mostly ungrateful people they just come and that you you never find words of gratitude from them out because they spend all those words worrying and while worrying they complain oh, I wish um, I those kind of things so they have a mindset to worry but you know one thing is that all this can change why I'll give you myself as an example that's there were times, yes, I had, I would just sit down and I would just like, okay, what can I do? That time, I might not be able to do everything, right? 
I can't, as in fact, most of the times I, I can't change anything at that point. I could not have. But now I know I can. I can cause changes to situations around me. I can cause changes to whatever is happening around me. I'm in charge, I'm in control of life. Not because of anything, because of the power of God. I know who I am. So there is there is a power that crosses through you. One is that I'm a spirit being. So the spirit controls the physical. Instead of worrying and complaining about it, I just even if it's ten minutes I spent speaking in tongues, sure is going to happen. So change. It, it's something that's going to happen. I am sure concerning that. So instead of worrying, I will tell you one is that if you have not gotten the Holy Spirit today, receive the Holy Spirit. And you will, you will direct your path that you need to follow. Sometimes some people are just in the wrong path for their life. And that's why they're worrying all the time. They're facing continuous trouble every day continuous problems because of them they have not yet come to the knowledge of, of who they are and as you study the word yeah the holy spirit i say it shows you it shows you the way out that's the thing it shows you the way out it shows you the way out I'll tell you, don't be despondent. Because those worries, they've come to an end. If you're listening to this, um, to this um, broadcast today, those worries have come to an end. You can do anything. 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 Ah, yeah. Anything. Not, not some things. You can do all things. She cries and energizes you. So I'll leave you with this word today. Is that stop worrying. You can cause a change to that situation. Because you're born of God. And if you have not received Jesus Christ, there's no way they can help you. You have to receive Jesus Christ. Do you see this? There is a prayer of salvation that is that will be linked to this. So just say that prayer of salvation. And God bless you. Thank you for joining me today. I love you all. This is Life with Christy. I just knew I had to do this with you. I just knew I had to do this with you. I love you all. God bless you. See you next week.